นะกูดีนิ่งกูดีบินฮัลโหลฮัลโหลฮายกายส์ฮัลโหลฮัลโหลฮายกายส์ sorry I was just trying to find some information hello everybody good day good evening good evening good evening hi Why? Hey, hey, thank you. I'm fine. Thank you, Menemo, for asking. Thank you very much. I work. Tired. Tired. Oh man, I'm sorry to hear that. The good thing is that you are here. The good thing is that you are here today, and that's really fantastic. Hi, we. I find. Project. I have. We have very few people today. Well, it's early. It's early. That's why. But we have very few people. Why? Right, let's start here. Wilmer. Hi, Wilmer. Welcome. How are you? Fine. You how everything in San Vicente? Huh? So everything in uh, <laughs> the in San Vicente. <laughs> you are you are there right now. Uh, no, I, I am from Santana. Uh, I thought you were from San Vicente. No, ah, no I'm, from, I'm from Usulutan. Usulutan. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yes, yes. I'm, I'm from here. Yes. Yeah. How, how is the weather over there? Actually, you know, it's it's kind of weird because it changes constantly. It changes constantly. Uh, uh, last week, last week it was very hot. At, well, at this moment, at this time, at uh, 8 p.m., 9 p.m., it's very hot. But in the morning, at around 1 or 2 a.m., it starts to get really cold. And in the morning, at 6 a.m., it's super cold. It's really weird, and it changes like that. Yes. Yeah. When I was uh, in Boy Scout group, I, mm -hmm. we went to Pe Perkin and oh, mm -hmm. Valle de Muerto, Morazan. Mm -hmm. very, very nice. Oh, I, know, I know I have been there. Oh, okay. That's really cool. That's really cool. Yes. The place, the place yeah. that I don't, the place that, that for me that has been the coldest is uh, Chalapenango. I went to this place one time and it's really, really, well, I went to a high place. That's why uh, it, it was very cold. It was very cold. It was like three or four years ago. No, more. Like five, yeah. seven years ago. Yes. I, well, I'm glad that you're here. What happened to you yesterday? You left the class. Yeah, DJ, it was very late for me because I today I had to to wake up very early oh okay i understand don't worry about it i i, just, I, I kind of uh, figured that out that you were tired so you needed to sleep I'm like that, that's okay it's fine it's not a problem yes okay, thank well, you. i'm glad that you're here today yes thank you Jim. yes all right Miriam, hello Miriam. hello good night teacher how are you 
Sorry, good evening. Oh, sorry. <laughs> there you go. There you go. It's okay. It's okay. Don't worry. Good evening. How are you? How are you, Miriam? I'm fine, teacher. I'm you happy? Fine. Thank you. Are you happy? Yes. Yes, are... today is Friday and I'm happy. Oh, yes. Are you are you going to work tomorrow? Yes. Oh no. Yes, I work. That's work not good. That is not good. Oh man. That is not good. Oh me too. Only I'm going... four hours. Sorry? Only four hours. Oh four hours. Oh, it's just from, from eight to twelve. Yes. Yes. Okay. That's really good. That's really good. Um, tomorrow, I, I don't really like Saturdays because I work the whole day. I start working at 7.30 a.m. and I finish at 5 p.m. Yes. Uh, I work from the beginning of the day to the end of the day. So it's really, really hard for me. Really yeah. hard for me. Yes. Yeah. All right. Well, I'm glad that you're here, Miriam. I'm really happy that you're here. Thank you. Yes. Yamilet Lucero, hello. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Oh, no. Are you OK? Um, so, so. Oh, all right. What is your baby? Uh, my baby asleep. Oh, he's sleeping? Oh, that's good. That's good. Yes, that's good, for, good for the baby and good for you. <laughs> <laughs> And yeah. my baby. Sorry? My baby. Mm -hmm. Good for you. Yes. Your baby is sleeping. Yes. <laughs> All right. Mr. Doño, hello, Mr. Flowers. Mr. Flores, Flowers, no? Okay. <laughs> How are you? Good evening. How are you? Yeah. So, so. <laughs> Why? What's wrong? Uh, very tired. Very tired. <laughs> and, and I have headache today. A what? Sorry. I have headache. Oh, headache, headache. today. A headache. Yes. Okay. How is how is your your sight? Repeat this. How is your sight? Oh. So so in the morning my eye hurts. And and what is the problem, Alexandra? Um no sé, ya se me se me revienta un pasito de ojo. Oh really? Como como una marrera. Ah, I understand. And are you are you in a in a how can I say under a treatment? Uh, are you are you yeah. under a treatment for that problem? Look, Alex, they're moving on. Good on this. I don't understand it. Y si estaba bajo tratamiento o algo por el estilo. Oh, it's, 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 sí, 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 sí. No, okay. Pero pues, creo que todo le mejore, okay. Yes. Yes. All right. The best luck for you. <laughs> All right. Yes. Thank you. No problem. All right. <clears throat> Jose Arnoldo Correa. Hello. Good evening. Hello from the other side. No. Okay. He's not there. Mr. Ricardo. Alvarenga, Mr. Alvarenga, Alas. Hello, sir. Hey, how are you? I'm not very good. Happy? Yes, I'm happy. I see that you're still working. I'm still starting working. Uh, are you gonna work the whole night night today? Yes. Oh. <coughs> well, I'm sorry. 
I gotta say, I'm sorry for you. No worry, that's why I'm happy because no. I'm going to work the whole night. <laughs> you be sarcastic, right? <laughs> no. You happy? No, right? no. Yeah, why not? <laughs> I don't know. I mean, you're going to be staying up late, not sleeping. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> That's okay. That's okay. Oh, well, I'm yeah. glad that you. I'm glad that you're happy. Thank you. Yes. Thank just, you. just do your thing, okay? Just do your thing. I right? enjoy. It. Yeah. Ricardo didn't Thank you. work, teacher. Just sleep all night. <laughs> okay. It doesn't work. He sleeps the whole night. He <laughs> said that because uh -huh. when he come to work here, he do that. I don't know why. He sleeps. He's the one that sleeps. Yeah. <laughs> he. That's, okay. that's why he's saying that. Oh, okay, I understand. Right. Yeah. Well, where do you work, Ricardo? Um, I work in the airport. Oh, in the airport. Ah, right, that's cool. Yeah. Right. Yeah. This time there's not there's not much mo mo movement over there, right? No, there is not. Oh, okay, that's something. That, that, it's okay. quiet. That's why you enjoy yeah. because you don't do anything. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, welcome, uh, Ricardo. I'm glad that you're here. Thank you. Yes. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. Right. Excellent. Nubia, hello, Nubia. How are you? Hello, teacher. I am fine. Happy? <laughs> Happy because it's Friday. Are you go? Are you? That's really. I'm happy for you. Are you going to work tomorrow? No, no, no. Oh, no. that's good. I'm happy. I'm really, really, really happy for you. Mm -hmm. And yes. I, I envy you. I, I actually envy you. What teacher? I envy you. Oh, okay. Yes. Pero de la buena. Yeah, exactly, 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 of course. <laughs> of course. Yes, I'm going to work tomorrow. Yes. All right. Excellent. Uh, Welcome. I'm glad that you're here again. Yes. Okay. Hey, Jose. Hello. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Are you sleeping? Um, not yet. Maybe not yet. later. Because that, that's what 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 Ricardo In said. We were sleeping. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's, that's what he said. But in my in my house, when I, I nah, when I go work, I cannot sleep because I'm working. Oh yeah, good. Oh man, that that's okay. All right. Well, I'm glad that you're here, Edgar, and welcome. Thank you, teacher. Excellent, excellent. Hello, Judy. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? <clears throat> Very well, teacher. Thank you. Excellent. Very excellent. tired. I can imagine. Yes. By the way. Yes. Well, I'm glad that you are here, Judith, and I'm sorry that you're tired. Okay, the good thing is that you are in your house. Mm. Okay. Right. Hello, Sonia and Ed. Sonia, hello. Sorry? Sonia and Ed. Hi. Good evening. Hi, how are you? How are you? Yeah, so so. Why? What's wrong? Oh, normal, right? Yes, I know, I know. I understand. It's viernes, it's viernes. It is Friday. It's Friday. El cuerpo lo sabe. La acumulación toda la semana trabajando. Sí. Sí. Soy domingo también. Uh.
Well, I'm sorry to hear that. Yes. All right. Well, I'm glad that you're here. I'm happy to see you again. Okay. Brenda Lisette, hello. Hello, teacher. How are you, Brenda? How's, how's everything? Uh, a little tired because I get up very early all week, but I am happy because it's Friday. <laughs> and you're not going to work tomorrow? No, tomorrow no, I don't work. Awesome, awesome. That's really good news. I'm happy for you, Brenda. Yes, you deserve to rest. Yes. You deserve to rest this weekend. Yes, I'm glad that you are you are okay, and that you're happy. Yes, thank you for for joining the class and welcome. Thank you. Yes. Hello, Elvin. Good evening, Elvin. Hello, teacher. Hi. How are you? I'm fine, teacher. Excellent. What happened to you yesterday? Uh, the world every day, uh, all day. No, yesterday. What happened to you yesterday? Ah, uh, problem internet. Oh, internet problems. Okay. Here you go. Mm, I understand. I understand. Okay. The good thing is that you are here, Elvin, and that you are you're fine. Right? I'm glad to see and have you here in the class again. Yes. Good. It's good. Fine. Right? Uh, Sarah Ives. Hello, Sarah Ives. How are you? Hello, teacher. I'm Hello. fine. And you? I'm high, I'm fine. Yes, I'm okay. Not happy, not sad, neutral. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yes, okay. Yes. How is everything? How are you? No, okay. <laughs> okay, todo, todo good. Okay, todo good. <laughs> fine. That is perfect. Menedemo, how are you, Menedemo? How are you, teacher? I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. Excellent. Where are you going to sleep? I was asleep. He slept for a little bit. No, I'm tired. 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 I'm Ahí estaba Doño llorando, Wilma llorando. Ah. <risa> y la que nos enseñan a hacer manualidades para que no lo tomamos. <risa> Está bueno. Excelente. Ok. Es Bienvenido. El poder de la mujer que puede hacer más de una cosa a la vez. Excelente. <risa> Está bueno. Excellent, excellent. Perfect. All right. Very good. Welcome, Menedemo. I'm happy you're here. Yes. Hello, Iris. Iris, Johanna. Hello. You are late. <laughs> Hello, Peter. How are you? I'm fine. Excellent. Oh, you haven't seen attendance. Happy? Yes? Yes, yes. Happy. Excellent, excellent. I'm glad that you're happy and welcome. Good to see you again. Thank you. Yes. Carla Patricia, hello, hello, hello. Hello, teacher. How are you? Fine, thanks, and you? I'm okay, everything is perfect. I'm happy. No, I'm not happy, I'm okay. It's okay. All right, I'm glad you're here. All right. People, uh, déjeme decirles en español, El, el examen de medio mes o de medio curso más bien uh, hay personas que aún no lo han hecho no sé si ya lo, lo hicieron los que no lo habían hecho pero tengo acá a unas cuantas personas tengo una uh, bueno tengo dos que no lo han completado y tengo a, a tres personas no dos también que están a medias ok creo que lo demás está bien solamente eso Teacher. Yes. Y con los minutos. ¿Cómo, cómo voy yo? No, ya, 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 
que todo va bien. Unos poquitos van un poco bajos, pero todo va bien. No se preocupen. Ok. Ok, thank you. Teacher. Yes. Eh, vamos amigo, vamos bien amigo. mal. <ríe> A mí no. una compañera me ayudó a, a unas que me habían salido malas, pa. pero, pero siempre me tira rojo, porque aunque la haya puesto siempre la, como me la dieron, pa. algunas, me sale rojo, no sé por qué, y el porcentaje, pero estaba bajo. Mm, ya. Yo se puede notar que tenía un porcentaje bajo. Bueno, pues va a hacerlo entonces, gente. Haga lo posible. Que, no, pues, si siempre la arreglo, la mando y después me vuelve a decir, pone rojo y no me digo. Eso. Pero tiene Juan Ricardo, vea uh -huh. eh, las letras mayúsculas, los puntos al final también y la modificación ah. de las palabras. Ah, ok, ok, gracias. Vamos a voy a revisar otra vez antes. Okay. De dormir. Yes, please. Okay, Bye. okay. Let me take attendance real quick here. We have Alexander, Aaron, Toño, Flores. <laughs> Brenda Lizel García Oriana. Present. Lacey Yesenia Mesquita Martinez, not here yet. <clears throat> Elvin Alexander Alvarado Díaz. Present, teacher. Iris Joana Cañas Morales. Present. Wait, hold on. Jose Arnoldo Correa Jovel. Present. Juan Ricardo Varenga Ala. Present teacher. Juan Ricardo Menedemo Delgado Vázquez. Present teacher. Uh, Carla Patricia Pineda López. Ustedes están ahí. Here. Francisco Javier. Hi. Joana Guadalupe. Bien, ya. Cecilia Ruiz Morán. No. Rafael Antonio Marientos Chinchilla. I'm sorry. María Cela del Carmen Velázquez, Velázquez Diasis. Present teacher. Rafael Antonio Marientos Chinchilla. Ronald Alexis Mendo Gómez Mendoza. Sara Yvette González García. And here. Sonia Miriam Cortés Vargas. Present. Sonia Yanet Martínez de Orellana. And here. Wilmer Fabricio Morales Cáceres. Present. I do. Yes. Judy Araceli Cuellar Hernández. Present, teacher. <coughs> Carla Maritza Sánchez Mesa. Nubia Zulema Maritza Cortés Chávez. Present teacher. Karen Elena Vázquez Hernández. Ok. Beatriz Yamilet Lucero Pérez. Present teacher. En Edgar José Cruz Amaya. All right, very good. Well, welcome everybody. Let's start. Let me share the book with you. Today we have a very interesting topic. Okay, uh, you will see that it's a little interesting. It's about idiomatic expressions in English and it's something very complex. All right, here we go. Uh, in today's class, I will be able to make a phone call to report sickness. I will be able to make a phone call to report sickness. Guys, what is sickness? Yes, yes, right, that's what it is. That's what it is, all right. Then we have the question number one here. <clears throat> Do you often get sick? Excuse me. What are the procedures to report a work absence? It says, do you often get sick? What are the procedures to report a work absence? 
We're going to yes. Call my boss. Mm -hmm. And what else? Mm -hmm. Go to the doctor. Mm -hmm. uh, or give me a, a Constancia America. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, pretty much that's what they what they want to my it's to my my is to my stomach. My to my stomach. Así se pronuncia. No, stomach. 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 All right. Okay. Thank you, uh for for sharing that information. Anybody else? Anybody else? Okay, I'm going to ask you directly. Judy, what's what's the, do you often get sick? Mm -hmm. What is the, yeah. tell me, tell me. Do you often, uh, okay, mm, no, I don't. Uh, and and uh, what is but what's the procedure to to uh, report an absence? Uh, call the supervisor. Mm -hmm. And uh, go go the yes. Mm -hmm. And. Luego, como entregar la incapacidad, si, si es necesario. And, and, and turn in, and turn in the, the medical evidence. Okay. Turn in the medical evidence. All right. Pretty simple, right? Well, in my case, uh, in my company, people, the procedure is different. Okay, it's different. Let's say, for example, that today I get sick and tomorrow I cannot go to the company. What the company does is that they get, they get another person, another teacher, and they cover they cover my class, and I don't get paid. That's simple. Okay. It doesn't matter if I am sick. Uh, okay. I just tell them, look, I'm sick. I cannot go tomorrow. So find somebody else. No problem. Huh? It's very simple. I think that that way that that way is very very easy and you don't complicate that much. All right, that's what it is. Brenda said hello. Give us your opinion, please. Um, I think the fear. Um, go to the hospital mm -hmm. and and ask ask for. For a medical certificate. Uh -huh. Or you can um, say you can say medical evidence. Uh, you can say the medical, uh, medical certificate medical or, or the medical evidence. Okay. Uh, um, um, I don't know how to present. Present. Oh, and, and uh, mm. turn it in. Turn it in. Turn it in at work. In our work. Mm -hmm. Okay. Give it to the to the supervisor or to the boss. All right. Yes. That's okay. That's okay. That's perfect. Uh, what about you, Sonia and Ed? What's what's the procedure with you and in your company? Um, um present mm -hmm. incapaz. Um Uh -huh. Yeah, um, hablar con la jefa. No sé cómo se dice. Talk, talk to Allá. my boss. Talk to my boss. Talk to, talk to my boss. Talk to, talk to my boss. Mm -hmm. What else? Always. Sí, yes. That's it. All right. 
Okay. Uh, yeah. Thanks, thanks. What about you, Elvin? What's the procedure there? Tell me. What's the procedure there, Elvin? Hello? Uh, uh, I'm calling my, my supervisor. Mm -hmm. I see I will counsel. Consulta, no sé cómo es. Appointment, appointment. Appointment. Uh, present capacidad. Oh. Present the, 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 the medical. I see this. And before the company, uh, more seven days. Seven okay. days is part of the capacity that me da the seguro. Uh, it depends on how I understand. I understand. All right. So the processes are like pretty much the same. You, uh, Call, maybe you let me get myself when you call the supervisor you call your boss and then you go to the doctor the doctor gives you the medical evidence you go to the company you give the document to the boss and the same procedure right and pretty much the same right that's that's really good perfect thank you very much for that now we're going to continue with the next part which is the conversation in the conversation, I will need you to ask me because uh, this will be a little confusing or difficult to understand, okay? It says, let me read the conversation. Guys, please, let's listen to this carefully and then you will practice. You already know what to do. <clears throat> it says, good morning. This is Mr. Reese. Hello, Mr. Reese. This is Jenny. I have a situation. Hi, Jenny. Tell me, what's the matter? I'm not feeling well today. My stomach is killing me. I am um, as sick as a dog. Okay, I understand. Two days ago, I was uh, feeling under the weather too. Oh, really? There's something going on around, going on, going around. I hope you are feeling better. Oh, yeah, I'm in tip top shape. Take it easy, Jenny. I hope to see you on Monday. Thanks a lot, Mr. Reese. Have a nice rest of the day. Let me read again. Good morning. This is Mr. Reese. Hello, Mr. Reese. This is Jenny. I have a situation. Hi, Jenny. Tell me, what's the matter? I'm not feeling well today. My stomach is killing me. I'm sick. I'm as sick as a dog. Okay, I understand. Two days ago, I was feeling under the weather too. Oh, really? There is something going around. I hope you're feeling better. Oh yeah, I'm, I'm in tip top shape. Take it easy, Jenny. I hope to see you on Monday. Thanks a lot, Mr. Reese. Have a nice rest of the day. Guys, is there a question about the vocabulary? As sick as a dog. Okay. As sick as a dog. As sick as a dog. Yes, I'm enfermo. Exactly. Thank you, Ricardo. Really sick. Really, really sick. It's killing me. It's killing me. Ah, my stomach is killing me. My stomach is killing me. Literalmente sería mi estómago me está matando. But it's... Calling me. Calling me. Calling. Killing me. Killing. Killing me. Killing me. My stomach is killing me. me. Like I said, literally, me. my stomach is killing me. But in this case, it would be, guys? It's killing me. Okay, uh -huh. I have a mal in the stomach or I have problems with the stomach. That's what it is. Okay, what else, what else? Under the weather. Under the weather, que se siente un poco mal. Weather. There is so many come around. Okay, under the weather, under the weather is que se siente poco mal. O comienza a sentirse mal. Okay. Yes, to feel under the weather. TikTok Chuck K I Hashi. Okay, okay, thanks. And the next one is there is something going around. Es como que algo está pasando. Okay. Algo está pasando. 
Y en el otro one, el siguiente es la que dijo Menedemo, I mean, tip, tip top, tip top shape, ok, que está mucho mejor. That's what it is, que se siente bien. Yes, that's what it is. Uh, in, in English, these, these things, these, these are called idioms, ok, or idiomatic expressions. In Spanish, son modismos, ok, como lo que tenemos en español. Aquí decimos de tal palo, tal astilla, ok, de tal palo, tal astilla, uh, y por otro, otro, in Spanish. Dicho, como dichos. Exactly, modismos, ajá. Uh -huh. In Spanish, people, uno, uno. Spanish. Sí, no me da ninguno. Tranqui, Ruiz, hi, nice. Oh, oh. Ok. Perfect, perfect then. All right. Thanks for that. Uh, I'm going to send you. I need you to come to continue practicing the conversation. Memorize, please. Memorize the idioms. And we're going to continue with the part three. Okay. In the groups, please practice the conversation. And I'm going to be monitoring. I need you guys to, to do that. Here we go. All right. I will see you guys in the groups. Please practice the conversation and do part number three. And please try to memorize the meaning of the idioms. All right. Go ahead. I will see you. I will see you in the groups, people. Sorry, Beth, hello. Hi, Brenda. Go, oh, join the group, please. I will see you there. Hi, Daisy. Hi, teacher. You are super late. <laughs> it's okay. Go to the group, okay? I will see you in the group. Thank you. Yes. It's time to join a group. Ya la encontró. Ya, si quiere comencemos. Maestro, lo que dice también Sara. Lo usa. Quiere iniciamos en lo que ella se, bueno. se puede conectar. Maya. Good morning. This is Mr. Ruiz. Hello, Mr. Ruiz. This is Jenny. I have a situation. Hi, Jenny. Tell me, what's the matter? I know. Well, today my stomach is killing me. 
I am I am a dog. Okay. Hi on that day. Today ego I was feel feeling under the weather, weather too. Weather too. Oh really? There's something going around around. I hope you are feeling better. Oh yeah. I'm in the top chip. Take it easy, Jenny. I hope to see you on Monday. Thanks. Hello, hello, Mr. Ruiz. Have a nice rest of the of the day. Hi. Good morning. Excellent. This is Mr. Okay. Finish. Continue. Continue. I'm going to go to a different group. Okay? I'm going to go to a different group. Continue, please. Okay. And continue with part, continue with part three, all right? It is. It I it. Easy? No. Easy? Easy. Uh, easy. Jenny, I hope to hope. see you go on Monday. Perdón? I hope. Mm. I hope to see no, hope. you on Compe. Monday. So, compare, Sonia. Hope. Stop. Nada, sí va. <coughs> I hope to see you, you on Monday. Thanks a lot, Mr. Reese. I have a nice rest of the day. Good morning. This is Mr. Ruiz. Hello, Mr. Ruiz. This is Jenny. I have a situa situation. No. Situation. 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 Hi, Jenny. Situation. Hi, Jenny. Uh -huh. Hi, Jenny. Tell me what's the matter. I'm not feeling well today. My stomach is killing me. I'm as sick as a dog. Okay. <laughs> I use them. Understand. 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 Two days ago. I have feeling, no, Fe feeling, Fe feeling under the, under the weather, pardon, under, under the, the, with the, ah? the weather, the weather, the weather. No, the weather. weather, under the weather, the weather, too. Teacher, eh, ¿qué significaba I see as a dog? Muy enfermo, very sick. Okay. Okay. Really, there's something going around. I hope you're feeling better. Oh, yeah. I'm in tip-top shape. Take it easy, Jenny. I hope to see you on Monday. Thank you. I love Mr. Ruiz. I have thanks a lot. Easy... Oye, empiezo yo, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Good morning. This is Mr. Ritz. Ritz. Hello, Mr. Hello, Mr. Ritz. It is Jenny. I have a situation. 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 Hi, Jenny. Tell me what's the matter. I am not feeling well today. My stomach is killing me. I am not seeing as a dog. I not feeling well. The siguiente, va? No. Okay. Sí, ahí. I was feeling. Bye. Si quiere practicamos, comience usted. Bye. Good morning. This is Mr. Ruiz. Hello, Mr. Ruiz. 
this is Johnny. I have a situation. Hi, Johnny. Tell me what thy mother. I'm not feeling well today. My stomach is killing me. I'm as sick as a dog. Okay. After then, today I go. I was feeling under tight winter too. Weather, oh, Eva. Weather. 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 Two. Weather too. Uh -huh. Weather too. Oh, There's something going around. I hope you are feeling better. Oh, Jer, I think talk chatping. Take a high seat, Johnny. I hope I see you on Monday. Thanks a lot, Mr. Wiz. Have a nice rest of the day. Si quiere, empezamos otra vez. Right. Es la... Va, dele. Es que teacher Karen está trabajando ahorita. Sorry. Karen está trabajando ahorita, por eso no puede interactuar con nosotros. Yes, I know, I know. Está manejando, quizás. No, está trabajando, ya me dijo ya. No se preocupe. Ah, okay. va, va. Es okay. mío, okay. tú, ok. Continue, continue. Uh, good morning, this is Mr. Ruiz. Hello, Mr. Ruiz. This is Ayane. I have a situation. Hi, Jenny. Tell me, as the mother. I know feeling with I, my stomach. A feeling me, a young chick, I adopt. Okay, I understand. Two days ago, I was feeling under the weather too. On rarely, I did a swimming gone around. I Ope, you are a feeling. Hmm? Oh yeah, I am. I'm in tip top shape. Take it easy, Johnny. I hope to see you on Monday. Thank you, a lot, Mr. Ruiz. I have an easy race all day. All that day. Okay. Right. Okay, guys, continue with part three. Answer part three, okay? Okay. Later. okay. Thanks a lot, Mrs. Lewis. Have a nice rest of the day. Huh? Usted empiece ahora, Leo. Huh? Good morning. This is Mr. Reese. Hello, Mr. Reese. This is Jenny. I have a situation. Hi, Jenny. Tell me, what's the matter? I'm not feeling well today. My, st my stomach just is killing me. I'm as sick as, as a dog. Okay, I understand. Two days ago, I was feeling under the weather too. Oh, really? There's something going around. I hope you are feeling better. Oh, yeah. I'm in tip top shape. Take it easy, Jenny. I hope to see you on Monday. Thanks a lot, Mr. Ruiz. Have a nice rest of the day. Okay. Finish part three, teacher. Excellent. You are very intelligent. <laughs> yes. Thank you. Thanks. Okay, perfect. Do you do you understand the idioms? ¿Alguna vez han visto Sorry? alguna vez han visto los modismos en inglés? No. No. Algunos, pero es el de bajo el clima sería under the weather. Ajá, ese es, es, es así sería literalmente. Una expresión, un modismo o un dicho en, en inglés 
uh, bueno, se dice de una forma y significa otra cosa. Literalmente, under the weather sería bajo el clima, pero realmente significa que se siente un poco mal. Es como que diga, I feel bad. Me siento mal, de salud. Estoy mal. Yo puedo, decir, yo puedo decir, I feel bad or I feel under the weather. Y under the weather no significa que estoy bajo el clima, sino okay, que me siento mal. <ríe> Esos son los idioms. Está bien. asociada. ¿Mm? Ok, people. Están asociadas. Yes, yes, yes. All right. People. I will go to a different, I will go to a different group, okay? Okay. John, have a nice day. Have a nice day. Que esté bien o que descanse bien. Que esté bien el resto del día. Que tenga un. Que tenga un buen día. Ajá. No. Eso significa que se ajá. Have a nice rest of the day. Of the day. Mm -hmm. No dice you know. solamente. Que tenga, un buen, que tenga un buen día. Sí, sí. Que esté bien el en, este caso, en este caso, que tenga un buen día sería porque quizás las personas, cuando estaban hablando, quizás eran como las 11 o las 12 de la mañana. De la, mm -hmm. noche, perdón, de la tarde. O sea, era en la mañana, era en la mañana. Ya voy. Ah, sí, sí. Ay, que bien el resto del día. Quizás era como, como las 10 o las 11 cuando dijo eso. Para que... ah. Porque si fueran las 6, sería solo have a nice day. Or have a good day. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Depende de la hora para que la expresión. Yes. Guys, <coughs> do you understand? Sorry. Do you understand? Do you understand idioms? Sí, me estaba más escribiendo, es como que estoy muy, estoy, estoy mal de los ojos. Okay. Así que ese dog es como que estoy muy enfermo. Cuando el dibujo era fue que no me quedó muy claro, pero como que. Cuando el dibujo ah, comenzó como que comienza a sentirse mal. Cuando el dibujo era, exactly, exactly. That's... Es, en ese caso, the weather es como que me siento mal, me estoy sintiendo mal. Me estoy sintiendo mal también. Uh, yeah. uh, is there something going around? Yes. Como que algo está pasando. Ajá. Uh -huh. top shape es como que soy mejor. Ya soy mucho mejor. Me siento mejor. Exactly. Take it easy. Bás básicamente. Es las... como toca, tómalo con o como tranquila, tranquila ah, pues, tómalo con calma, tómalo con calma okay. Okay. prácticamente los, los idioms que se, o sea, así se llama en inglés idioms son uh, expresiones que no tienen el mismo significado literal ok porque si vemos ahí dice under the weather literalmente sería bajo el clima o debajo del clima pero no se traduce así ok se traduce como me siento mal, me estoy sintiendo mal. Esa es la belleza de los de los de los uh, de los uh, de los idioms. Por otro tan enfermo como un perro. Así sería, así sería, ¿verdad? O sea, literalmente tan enfermo como un perro. De hecho, sería eh, eh, estoy, estoy tan enfermo, tan enfermo como un perro. Así sería. Es, es, uh, okay. Sí, me siento. <laughs> okay. Well, did you finish part three? Did you finish part three? Yes. Yes. Okay. Excellent. Let me go to a different group. Okay. I will see you later. Bye. Bye. Comience usted nuevamente. Bye. Good morning. This is Mr. Ruiz. Hello, Mr. Ruiz. This is Jenny. I had a situa situation. Hi, Jenny. Tell me. What's the matter? I'm not feeling well today. My stomach is killing me. I'm sick as a dog. 
Okay, I understand. Two days ago, I was feeling under the weather too. Oh, really? There is some time going, to, going around. I hope to I feeling better. Oh, yeah. I'm um, in tip-top shape. Take it easy, Annie. I hope to see you on Monday. Thanks a lot, Miss Swiss. I had a nice race of today. Hi, teacher. Hi, I'm here. I'm listening. Yes. Yes. I'm listening to you guys. No, no, no. No. Did you finish the part three? Yes. yes. Okay, Maricel, Maricel, one, there. And number one, and the answer is because he cheats six, she don't feel good and her stomach has feeling here. What's the right. feeling here, baby? Okay, yes, yes. And number two, like he holds to understand the situation because he has sick too. So he said that Jenny can rest during two days. Okay, that's that's okay. That is perfect. All right. Thank you very much for that. All right, perfect people. Let me go to the last group and we're done. Yes, last group. One more group and we're done here. All right. Hello. Oi. Hi, Patricia. We're talking about going. <laughs> about what? Going to sleep. Going to sleep. Not oh, really? going to sleep late. Man, let me tell you, one of these days, I don't, I'm not really sure. I think it was on Wednesday. On Wednesday, I was really, really tired. Really tired. It was, it was before 9 p.m. and I was already like this. Yeah. And I had to, I had to, you know, I had to stay up late. I mean, um, I have to stay up like this, okay? And I had to use my fingers to pinch myself. I had to pinch myself like this, man. On my, yeah. on, on my legs to, you know, to, to feel the pain and you stay awake. <laughs> that is worth it. <laughs> and I had to do that. Ricardo, you don't sleep over there during the night? No, I can't. Oh no! And what happens if you if you sleep? Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, no problem. Do you play any? No, the thing is that you should play we any. We can't. Oh, we can't. We can't. But I think it's the pen uh, with the partner that we are working. Mm. Yeah, we can do a turnover. Oh, okay. I get it. So uh, I'm going to sleep one hour, and then the other guy is going to sleep one hour. That's partnership. Yeah. That, is good. that is good partnership. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Yes, believe me. And what do you do? I wonder, what do you do over there? Like just the whole night? Nothing or just monitors? No, the thing is that I'm monitoring the cameras that we have here in the compound. Oh. So, yeah. I understand that. I understand that. Oh. All right. That's, that's, that's good. That's good. That's perfect. Yeah. All right. I'm, I'm guessing you finished the, the, the activity, all right? I'm, uh, I'm yeah. going yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna to close the, the, the... Okay. Okay. And I will see you guys in the main session. Yes. Okay. See you. See you. Three of us right here. 
What happened with the rest? Oh, they, there you go. <laughs> they get him back. That's it. Hey guys. Hello. All right. Um, did you? Well, I, I'm guessing you finished the part number three, and that's the one we, we are gonna check right now. It says uh, number one. Why can't Yanni go to work? Anybody? Because she feels she doesn't feel good. She doesn't feeling well. Okay, she's not feeling well because her stomach was killing her. So much. And she felt sick, as sick as a dog. Exactly, it's because her stomach, her stomach is killing her. All right, that's why she cannot go to work. All right, thank you very much for that one. The second one says, "How does how does Mr. Reese respond the, to the situation?" He understands the situations. Okay, he understands the, 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 the situation. Uh huh. What else? Tell her take it easy. Okay, tell her to take it easy and that he, he wants to see her on Monday. That's what he says. I cheat I feeling way. Uh yeah, stomach I I quilling me. Me? All right. Excellent people. Very good, very good. Okay, let me let me update. Okay, let me update the attendance. I'm going to update the attendance right now. Uh, Alexander Aaron Doño Flores. Yes, it is. And Alison Garcia Oriana. Present. Yes, Yesenia Mesquita Martinez. Present. Elvin y Alexander Abrao Díaz. Present. Y Joana Cañas Morales. Present. José Arnoldo Correa Jovel. Present. Juan Ricardo Varenga Alas. Juan Ricardo Menedemo Delgado Mar Vázquez. Presente, teacher. <coughs> Carla Patricia Pineda López. Kenia Cecilia. Hi. Kenia Cecilia, no, right? She's not here. Maricela El Carmen Velasquez Diasis. Present teacher. Maricela Patricia Mari, Mar, Mar, Maris, Mariselda. Mariseldea. ¿Cómo es su nombre, Maris? Ah, okay. Acá dice Mariseldea. Sorry. Teacher, buenas noches. Fíjese que me agarró la tarde. <laughs> Así podemos ver. <laughs> sí, sí, es que tengo un contratiempo también, te, por eso, un poco tarde, teacher. Ay, disculpe. Ok, don't worry, don't worry. Ok, bye, bye. lo bueno es que aquí está. Okay. okay. Better, better. Uh, I, I would say later. Okay. Todo lo veremos el, el ejemplo que le que hace. Um, thank you. Well, we have uh, Rafael Antonio Barrientos. No, está verdad. Lina Aura Quinoza de Acuña. No, ya no ha aparecido. Ronald Alexis Gómez Mendoza. Presente. Sara Ivette González García. Present. Sonia Miriam Cortés Vargas. Present. Sonia Inés Martínez de Orellana. Present. Wilmer Fabricio Morales Cáceres. Present. Julia Araceli Cuellar de Hernández. Present, teacher. Carla, Patri Carla Maritza, sorry. Carla Maritza Sánchez Mesa. Nubia Zulema. Present, teacher. Mm -hmm. 
Karen Elena Vázquez Hernández. Me pareció. Ah, esta, esta. She's, she's working. It won't. Uh, Beatriz Yamilet Lucero Pérez. Present teacher. And Edgar Chepe Cruz Amaya. I'm here, teacher. Present. All right. Guys, excellent. We're going to continue. Let me open the file here and we will go on. We're going to learn a little bit about, about the, the, the idioms. Here we go. Here we go. Let me know when you get to see the presentation. Okay. Yes. Okay. You see it now? Yes. Okay. Perfect. Uh, here. We have the, the uh, idiomatic expressions. Esos son los que están en el libro, okay? These are the ones that we have in the book. Let me read them to you. Listen to what, to the, the, the pronunciation and I will tell you the definition as well. The first one, the first one that we have is, the first one that we have is as sick as a dog. Oh, people, uh, let me tell you, the idioms, the idioms in English, we do not, we do not translate them into Spanish literally. Okay, we do not do that. Los, los, idiom, los idioms en español no se traducen literalmente, okay? No se puede hacer eso. Y si se hace, no tiene, no tiene sentido. Okay. Uh, for example, here we have... Como un kick. Sorry? Nothing, nothing. <laughs> okay. <laughs> for example, for example, we have as, as sick as a dog, okay? As sick as a dog. Guys, as sick as a dog is or means very sick. Okay, significa muy enfermo. Okay, yes, that's what it is. Okay, perfect. <clears throat> then we have under, excuse me. Then we have under the weather. Under the weather. Under the weather means people, alguien sabe? Or in the same situation. Como sentirse mal, sentirse enfermo. Okay. That's what it is, under the weather. Then we have, there's there's something going around. What is there's something going around? Okay. There's something going around? Hmm? Algo está pasando, okay? Yes, that's what it is. Uh, my stomach is killing me. My stomach is killing me. My stomach is killing me will be uh, in Spanish. <laughs> Me duele el estómago o, o estoy mal del estómago. Ok. Yes. Here we have take it easy. Take it easy. Guys, how would you say take it easy in Spanish? Relájate, me. <laughs> no, actually no. Actually no. In El, in el Salvador, in El Salvador, uh, it would be like this. <laughs> in, in Amuria, I saw it. <laughs> La de sin, relájate, querida. Te quiero decir. Go to the chat, go to the chat, you will, you will see that. Bueno, bonito, a ver. Right, así decimos, Salvador. Uh, right, people. Marita. <laughs> Tenemos una, unas expresiones bien raras. Decimos, ponte, ponte las pilas, ponte las pilas, ponte las pilas. <laughs> All right. Can afford to people. What is can afford to? Can't afford to. Can afford to in Spanish will be 
no me puedo dar el lujo de. No puedo darme el lujo de. Okay. Well, depending on the person, I can afford to lose more money. No puedo dar el lujo de perder más dinero. All right. So, can afford to estar, a darse el lujo de perder algo. Okay. Calling sick. Calling sick es bien común, bien usada en, en Estados Unidos. Calling sick es llamar a la oficina para reportar que está en tema. Sería llamar en enfermo, literal. Pero, okay. So, calling sick es llamar para reportar que está enfermo. Ok. Pick up shop. Hip top shop is shape. Sorry, shape. Hip top shape is when uh, when you feel good, when you feel well. When it starts being, it's it's being. That's what it is. Taki itch a chai. I see it. Taki itch a chai. Which one? What? Ah, tip top shape. Tip top. Tip top shape. Tip top check. Mm -hmm. There is something going around. Going around. There's something going around. Under the weather. Under the weather. Under the weather. Okay. Guys, Under thank you. Uh, now I need. Vamos a practicar. Vamos a ver a quién le vamos a preguntar. Quién nos da un ejemplo pequeñito de cada uno. Mr. Aron. Mr. Aron. <laughs> A Mr. Menedem, <laughs> Okay. Vamos a ver. Um, Elvin. Hi, Elvin. Can you give us an example with these idioms? Hi, teacher. I can repeat, teacher. Can you give us an example using one of the idioms? It's one of the idioms. Um, hmm? Uh, I, and here there is something going around. Okay. Uh huh. Relax. No. I am what, I I what I want, people, what I want is one example, un ejemplo, okay? Usando la una oración. Uno lo que está, cualquiera lo que está acá. And the and the part there is something going around the part Colombia. Okay, okay, that works. That works. Okay, thank you very much for that. It is you want to say something, Iris? Um, let me see. Um, the Monday. I calling in sick. You called in sick. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Thank you, uh, Patricia Millet. Give us an example. Hi. Hi, no? Maricela. Hi. Give us an example, Maricela. I'm sorry, teacher. Um, mm -hmm. I'm here. teacher, but I'm doing one moment. Me gustaría decir que pasó the Monday. Um, Ay, se me fue la palabra, teacher. Aquí está. Under the wear. Repeat, please. The Monday, um, under the wear. The Monday I felt. On Monday I felt under the weather. I was under the weather. Ay, me sentí mal. Yes. Así sería. I felt under the weather. I, On Monday. 
on Monday. I felt under the weather. I felt under the weather. Okay. okay. Yes. Thank you very much. Sara Ives, give us an example, Sara. Um, every day my stomach is killing me because I eat food with condimentos, condimentada, condiment. Uh, my lord. It's like when you use a lot of spicy food. Seasoning. Seasoned. Seasoned. Seasoned is no, condiment. Seasoned. 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 Food. Food. Uh -huh. okay. 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 Yeah, my, my stomach kill my stomach kills me when I eat a lot of churros. Yes. Uh, Especially when I eat when I eat uh, taqueritos, delicious. That's my exam. Huh? What do you say? That's my exam. Your exam? Example. Which one? When I when I eat takis. No. My stomach is killing me. But takis, no, brother. Yeah, packy. Disgusting. The, the purple one. I prefer I prefer taqueritos. <laughs> yeah. Good, that's, really good. that's good. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Frijoli chip. Ah oh, no. <laughs> Frijoli. Sí, Frijoli chip. Okay. Uh -huh. sí. Yes, they are delicious too. Okay. Very good. Relax que tengo hambre. Okay. <laughs> I'm hungry. Okay, perfect. Let me see. Uh, we're going to continue. Eso es lo que está en el libro, okay? Esto que les he mostrado acá. Yo traje también una, una lista pequeña también de otros, okay? Que también son comunes. Esto no tiene nada que ver con enfermedad porque el, el libro es de enfermedad, acerca de enfermedad, okay? Pero en este caso, no. Aquí está, está acá, no. Tenemos uh, better, better Late Than Never. Better late than never, people, in Spanish. Tarde que nunca. Mm -hmm. Okay. Tarde que nunca. Yes, yes. Huh? Right. A blessing in disguise. A blessing in disguise. Una <laughs> Es cuando pensamos que algo es malo, pero la verdad es bueno. No, se dice en español. Es cuando pensamos que algo está, que está malo, que estamos haciendo, pero la verdad es bueno. O nos va a venir a, a bien. A blessing in disguise. Disguise is disfraz. No, como, como decir que algo malo es sale algo bueno. Ajá, exacto. Yes. Ok, break, break a leg. <ríe> Literal es romper una pierna. La ¿no? <ríe> tarrajada. Well, break a leg is what, what Wilmer said. Good luck. Buena suerte, ok. Yes. Call it a day. What is call it a day, people? No? Call it a day. Es cuando ya... Supongamos que... Son como las 2 de la tarde en su compañía y usted está muy cansado y empiezan a pasar muchos problemas en la compañía y dice, oh, no, no, let's call it a day. Hasta aquí lleguemos, ¿ok? Call it a day es como terminar el día, ¿ok? De trabajo, por supuesto. Yes. All right. And then we have get out of hand. What is get out of hand? That is a heavy one. Está las manos encima. ¿Qué fue de las manos? Es salirse del control, ¿ok? O perder el control. Fuera de control. That's get, get out of hand. Yes. ¿Ok? Hang in there. What is hang in there? No. 
No. Hang in there oh, yeah. is aguanta. Okay. Ten paciencia. Ten paciencia. Hang in there. Ten paciencia. Then we have hit the books. What is hit the books, people? <laughs> now, hit the books is estudiar. <laughs> Literalmente, right? Okay. Speak of the devil. No, sorry. Hit the sacks. What is hit the sacks? Hide the sack. Hit the sacks. Los sacos. <laughs> Los sacos. No. Hit the sacks is dormir. Ir a dormir. Yes. Do you want to, guys, do you want to hit the sacks? Yes, teacher. Yes, me too. Yes. 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 Otra común de dormir es hit the cheats. The cheats. Cheats is sabana o, o, o como se llama? Colcha. Okay. Yes, yeah, I want to hit the cheats too. All right. Mm -hmm. Then we have speak of the devil. Hablando del día, Hablando del día. Hablando del día. O sea, como hablando del rey de Roma. Ah, exactly. Es lo que dijo Alexander, okay? Exactly. Speak of the devil. All right. A perfect storm. What is a perfect storm? Una perfecta tormenta. Okay, a perfect storm es un gran problema. Yes, that's what it is. A big problem. It's a big problem. That's why. That's why it is a perfect storm. Storms damage. A perfect one damages more. All right. Actions speak louder than words. Actions speak louder than words. Right. Actions speak louder than words. Yes. Break the ice. What is break the ice? All right. Everybody's quiet. <laughs> I see that. Everybody is like that. I. Right. When everybody's quiet, we have to break the ice. You know, I am. I am a very, a very good person at breaking the ice. Yes. I just, I break the ice like this, okay? I don't like it when people are quiet. I start to do some funny things to make people like and break the ice like this. Yes. That's what I do. <laughs> I'm a perfect, a perfect, I'm the perfect man for that situation. <laughs> bite the dust, what is bite the dust? Like the queen song, another by, by the dust. Mm -hmm. Good song. And another one. Another one. Ruta me de dejo la está cantando también. ¿Qué dijo? Quedó grabado. Es que te me de dejo está cantando la la de Queen. Quedó grabado eso. <laughs> right eye, right eye. No one. No. <laughs> oh no, that's no good. No van a censurar este grupo, teacher. Ahí lo voy a buscar. Okay. Oh no. Okay. Oh, oh no. Okay. Okay. Bite the dust, morder el polvo. Okay. Yes. Bite the dust. The dust, no, the dog, no, I have more than a good Bite the dust. The dust. Actions speak louder than words, teacher. Actions speak louder than words. Las acciones valen más que las palabras. Actions speak louder than words. Yes. All right, perfect. Okay. All right. Do you have more questions? Mm -hmm. 
All right. Good calling well, day today. Sorry? Calling the day. <laughs> no, we cannot do that yet. We cannot call it a day. <laughs> we're still, we're still, uh, well, more than 30 minutes. All right. Sorry. Guys, let's continue here in the book. And we have a situation. Yes. We have a perfect storm here. <laughs> All right. No, it's not a problem. Look at this. Uh, idioms are words or phrases which mean something different from their literal meaning. For example, to be up in one's ear in work, in work, it means to have a lot of work. And then we have eight things here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight is the ones that I was showing you before and the ones that I gave you a definition of. Uh, uh, so we're going to continue with the part number five, match the meaning with the idioms in part four, then compare with a partner. Uh, what you see here is the definition. What you have here is the definition. So you, in the spaces, in the spaces you're going to, excuse me, in the spaces that we have here, you're going to write down one of the idioms that we have up here. Okay? Yes. That's what we're going to do. Lo que está arriba es, la, la, es el modismo, lo que está abajo es la definición. En el espacio pondrán el modismo que ustedes piensan que es el que va ahí. ¿Ok? Yes. Five minutes, people. Cinco minutos. All right. Yes.
Nice. You're done. Are you done? You finish? Let me get my, get my charger because my computer is going to die pretty soon. Guys, did you finish? Finish. Okay, thanks. Number one, read it, Wilmer. My stomach hurts badly. My stomach is killing me. Okay, that one is pretty, pretty obvious, right? My stomach is killing me. One. Easy one, yes. Let me make this smaller because it's getting small and big. All right. Uh, Mr. Donio, next, number two. To be very sick. Mm -hmm. As sick as a dog. Number two. Yes, I know, I know, thanks. <laughs> Okay, Mena Demo, number three. Oh, I'm missing. Tere, so make it go. No, number three is people. Take it easy. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Right. Thank you. Thank you. Maricela, number four. Maricela. Yes, I'm here. Number four. Um, no. My stomach is kidding me. I ah, know, I'm sorry. No teacher, I think I'm mala. Okay, is people under the weather? Under the weather. Under the weather, under okay. The weather too. Yes, Miriam, number five. Tip top shape. In recognition, tip top shape. Uh, Sylvia, don't have time. The seat, the seat is 
can't afford to. Can, can't afford to. And number seven. Ronald, Ronald, number seven. There is something going around. Okay, there is something going around. Okay, and the last one is uh, Casey, read it. Call me sick. Sorry? Calling sick? Yes, that's what it is, pretty much. Call is calling sick. Calling sick, yes, that's what it is. All right, thank you very much. Thank you very much. All right, perfect people. Look at part number six, everyone. Your turn. Pair work. Student A, listen to this and read with me. <clears throat> Student A, you are sick. You are sick and call into your workplace to explain the situation. Student B, you attend the call and ask your classmate what the matter is. Then change roles. Use four to five from four to five idioms in your conversation. Okay. So in the conversation, one person is going to be sick, and the other person is going to take the call and is going to ask what is going on with the sick person. Okay. Use at least five five idioms. Okay, Rafael, welcome. I'm glad that you are here. Thank you, teacher. Yes. Better late than never. Yes. <laughs> right. Okay, people, nos vemos en la in the groups. Okay, see you in the groups. Okay, everybody's in the groups. Let's go. I have a problem with my with my No, it's okay. But digamos que sea así como hi, good morning, Ingeniero Aromba. jefe, Ingeniero Arum. I had um, no, ¿cómo sería? Esto es que tengo problemas de salud. ¿Cómo sería? Me siento mal. Ah, espérame, ¿cuáles vamos a ocupar? Ay, sí, ¿verdad? 
Y eh, podemos ocupar, pienso que también aquí en otro lado. Ah, bueno, sí, sí, puedo. Tengo esta. Uh, aquí está. Sí. Uh, under the weather. Uh, Tengo el under. Ajá. Me siento mal. O sea, puede decir me siento I know, mal. No, I don't está. work. I don't work today. ¿Verdad? I don't work today. Mm. Y ahí responde usted algo. Karen is working, right? Yes, Karen is working. And work, Karen. No, Maricela. Karen. ¿Me escuchan? Hello, Ah, oh, okay, okay. <laughs> hello, hello. Yes, I listen. Okay, perfect. Continue. I'm sorry. Okay. Bye, Aaron. ¿Qué le parece? Está bueno. Está bien. Pues, ajá. O pues, no, pues, no, ni. Pues, no sé. Eh, ahí puede decir usted. Ah, pero aquí las otras palabras. Puedo decir, bueno, ¿quién es que va a estar enfermo? Usted o yo. <ríe> o oh, Karen, no sé, Karen no aparece. Yo puedo decir buenos días. Este, Café por, o sea, es que está reportando que está enfermo. La llamo por la palabra porque estoy enfermo. Voy a colar. Uh, no, abandonó, se fue, se fue, se fue Maricela. <ríe> me dejó solo. Y que solo yo me quedé. <ríe> Hi, teacher. No, es que tengo que salirme para, para ver la, la imagen. Sí, ajá, tiene que, que como está en el teléfono, tiene que salirse para ver el manual. No, ok, sorry. Bye. Pero dejo el micrófono abierto, no sé si me escucha. No. Sí, sí, sí. <laughs> oh, ok, continue, guys. Yeah. Uh -huh. um, I'm hey, your, hello, guys. I'm your daddy. Huh? I'm your daddy. I'm your jefe. What did you, what did right, he say? Okay, thank you, bro. What did he say? Did I hear wrong? Huh? Did I hear wrong? He said something weird. What he said? I'm your your daddy, he said. <laughs> no, the thing is that he's uh, one of the guys who works here. Uh -huh. <clears throat> so I work in the, how can I say? I work in a military base mm -hmm. for the Navy. So he's... Uh, Green go. Oh, I get it. I yeah, get it. he came to our office and he asked me what I was doing. Oh, okay. what I was doing. So, yeah. And I told him I'm just taking English classes and blah, blah, blah. And I explained. Uh, I explained. Uh, yeah. Cool. That's perfect. <laughs> it's okay. Bye. Yeah. Yeah, I'm sorry. No problem. It's okay. He caught me. <laughs> it's okay. How is uh, the okay. conversation going? Um, we were started to work on that when the guy came. No, oh, okay. so blame, yeah. blame on him. <laughs> All right, continue, please. I will be back. Okay. I will, I'll be back here. Okay, thank you. Bueno. ¿Y cómo se escribe Mere? Mare o Mare. Mater. ¿Cómo? Mater. 
Matter. Uh, matter. Double T. Ah, okay. <laughs> What's wrong with you? We can say that. Y usted, ¿y cómo metemos a, a, a lo que vamos a meter? Después le, le cuento yo, ¿verdad? Que dijo Wilson. Yo me puse en Holland a seco. I'm going to talk with my supervisor or something like that. Mm -hmm. Ah, yeah. acaba. Take it easy, no problem. Take it easy, boy. Fifteen. <laughs> Take it easy, boy. Days free. <laughs> Entonces, ¿qué me contesta Wilma? Cuando le digo, what the matter? Um, maybe I got COVID-19. Yesterday I went to the clinic to, to do the test for COVID and maybe I am positive, you know. I'm going to have um, seven days uh, in a lockdown here in my house. Fifteen, seven. Seven or fifteen. It depends, you know. <laughs> I am asking someone for only three days, you know, no 15, and, and when I go to work. Yo le voy a decir como decía Mr. Ruiz. Ruiz, I take it easy. No, I take understand. It. Take it easy, le voy a decir. Take it easy. Relax. No, really, I, I, I don't feel well. Maybe. Tómese toda la medicina, le voy a decir. O, only mm. para hacer la Ah, acaba. For three days. Sorry. How do you say paracetamol in English? Paracetamol. 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 <laughs> paracetamol. <laughs> Solo le cambia el acento, entonces. I think, yes. you know, in the, in the U.S., in the U.S., the, the Americans or these people, they have the same medicine that we have in the Salvador. The only difference is that they have their own name. The name is different. I'm telling you because my cousins, my cousins or my family that lives in the U.S., they buy medicine, but it's difficult for them because, you know, the name is in English and they don't know or they don't really understand the, 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 the whole thing. So they, they, they ask medicine from here. That's why they go to the easy way. Yeah. yeah. Paracetamol. 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 Okay. I, I, ya no me acuerdo. I take it easy y de ahí. No, you, 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 can, you can say. Uh, Chill. I am así. As a dog. As a dog. Ahí sí, siempre continúo yo, ¿verdad? ¿Mande? No, ahí, ahí, ahí va ella. Ahí va no, Nuria. Y aquí, cuando él dice que tiene, que no se siente bien, que tiene dolor de cabeza, que lo está matando, entonces usted le, le podría decir, ok, que llame al Departamento de Recursos Humanos para que lo atienda. Uh -huh. Y ahí entro yo. Okay, as today, today I go, I what? I enter Teva. Teacher, how do you say recursos humanos in English? Human resources. Kira, a storefront. The chat. The chat. Ah, human resources. But it's a talk to the department. Human, uh, human resources. No, no. Human Resources Department. Uh, comúnmente, oh, okay. comúnmente se conoce como HR Department. Sulema, mm -hmm. Sulema. Okay. Así como lo puse en el chat. HR, HR Department. HR Department. Okay. Department. Department. Okay. The bottom end.
Spotify. Entonces hoy tendría que entrar eh, en el demo, eh, uh -huh. saludar y decir que habla él y de ahí entro yo. Vaya, entonces, ¿qué digo yo? Ya. Repito, ok, no, no, ya. Ok, Nubia. Um, Juan Ricardo. Today I go, I watch credit under, and I watch it there too. So, Are you guys done? Yes, teacher. Okay. You finished, right? Yes. Okay. Okay. I'm going to check on another group, okay? Thanks. Just wait. Yeah. Okay. Hang in here. <laughs> yeah. Quizás puede ser como el de there was something going around. Eh, eh, o también puede ser, puedo decirle ese como the boss and, and thanks for calling sick the boss como gracias porque este de calling sick es como llamar por enfermo vean así mm -hmm. como agradeciéndole thanks for calling sick. Thanks. Creo que esto. Thanks for calling sick. Thank you, Brenda. Um, um, calling sick. Y arriba donde le digo eh, really that bad for you, en vez de decirle that... Ajá. Uh -huh. Y luego tenemos que hacer como con uno, con otro. Entonces yo te voy a contestar. Yo te puedo contestar cómo darte. Quiero ver. ¿Desde cuándo? Ay, Patricia. Or, hey, guys. Hi. Did you finish the conversation? Uh, I think Carla is busy. Oh, she's not available? Okay, that's okay. Don't worry about that, okay? I understand. Okay. Yes. Let me just close. I'm going to close the groups right now. I will see you in the main session soon. All right. Thank you. Elvin, hello Elvin, qué vida. Hello, teacher. Cansancio. Tired. Estoy acostado en la cama, qué original. <laughs> ok. Bueno, who, who finished the conversation? No, teacher, no terminó. ¿Quién terminó? ¿Qué grupo terminó?
Ninguno. Nosotros quedamos a media, Richard. No problem. Ok, Edgar, que me termina con, con Iris. Iris, Edgar, please. Ok, ok. Ok. Hello, Iris, how are you? I see you a little bit sick. Are you okay? Hi, Edgar. I don't feel good. I feel under the water. I have a headache. All the week I speak as a dog. I have to go to the doctor. Really? That's too bad. I hope that you are, you are okay. But you have to go to the doctor as soon as possible. In my case, two days ago, my head was killing me. But right now, I'm a tip top shape. Right now, I will take some headache pills. Maybe I will make me feel better and I will take a nap. Oh, no problem, Iris. Take a rest and have a great day. Thank you, Edgar. Okay. Finish. Thank you, guys. Well done. Aaron, go ahead, please. Pero con motivación, Aaron, para participar. <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm sorry, teacher. No terminamos, teacher. It's okay, it's okay. Don't worry. No terminamos. Miriam, hello, Miriam. Hello, teacher. Okay, did you finish? No, it's little. Your conversation with Brenda. Okay, let me hear that. Go ahead. That's okay. Yes. Practice, please. practice. Go ahead. Brenda, are you here? I don't see you. Yeah. Yes, yes, teacher. I see you now. Okay. Good morning, Brenda. I am Sonny. Good morning, Sonia. How can I help you? Thank you, Brenda. I won't be able to get to the office. I'm Why? Feel, uh, I'm sick as a dog. Really? That bad for you. Take it easy. Don't worry. I tell the boss thanks for calling sick. Okay. All right. That's okay. It's okay. Better, better something than nothing, huh? Mauricio, what do you have? Yeah, my team was uh, Sara and Mr. Rafael. <laughs> okay, what do you have? <laughs> okay, we are going to call to Sara. Good morning, good morning, Miss Sara. Good morning. This is Mr. Sara. Okay. I'm calling because today I'm not feeling well. I think I got COVID-19. What the mayor? What the matter? Yeah. Yesterday I went to the clinic and I did a test for COVID-19 and I got positive. I understand. Take it easy. The hold on. I am going to communicate to make supervisor. Hello, Mr. Rafael. Wilmer have the situation. Okay, tell me. Uh, he is able to come today. Uh, just told him to bring in his medical incapacity. Okay, thanks, Mr. Rafael. I am reporting. Hi, Wilmer. Mr. Rafael says to us the incapacity and could bat on. Uh, uy, no, que ya no le puse lo más pronto posible and hope to get very soon. Okay, thank you, Miss Sara. Thank you for your support. I appreciate you. <laughs> Bye. All right. Excellent. Thank you guys for that. Nubia, you finish? Nubia, did you finish? Yes, teacher. 
Okay, can you please? Uh... Yeah, yes, please. Benedemo. Mm -hmm. Benedemo. Está listo, Benedemo. Yes, it is. Good morning. This is Mr. Diaz. Ya voy. Espera. Ah. Hello, Mr. Diaz. This is Juan, Juan Ricardo. I have a situation. Hi, Juan Ricardo. Tell me what's the matter. Elvi Diaz. I know very weird. Uh, today, I was a misquilling me and with my uh, adult. Uh, I share the problem. Okay, tell you the paramount recurso human, the source. Perdón. Hello, Nubia. Hey, Juan Ricardo. Nubia. Hi, Juan Ricardo. <laughs> I suggest you go to the doctor and ask for a medical certificate for your disability, to relax, to rest. Finish. Finish. Okay. Thank you guys for that. Let's let's continue. Uh, we're not going to continue because we have we have reached the, the the time. What I'm going to do, I'm going to take attendance and then we're free to go. All right, I'm just gonna update the attendance. Alexander Aron. <laughs> And then Lisette? Present. Daisy Yesenia? Present. Me, Alexander? Present, teacher. Iris Joana Cañas? Present. Jose Arnoldo? Present. Juan Ricardo Alvarenga? Present, teacher. Juan, uh, Juan Ricardo Menedemo? Present, teacher. Uh, Carla Patricia Pineda López. Present. Hi. Kenia no estuvo. Uh, Maricela del Carmen Velázquez. Present. Present, teacher. Uh, Rafael Antonio. Normal Alexis Gómez Mendoza. Present, teacher. Mm -hmm. Sara Ives González García. Present. Sonia Miriam Cortés Vargas. Present, teacher. Sonia Ives Martínez de Orellana. Present, teacher. Lino Mauricio Morales Cáceres. Present. Uh, Lino Arcelio Cuellar Hernández. Present, teacher. Carla Maritza, no estuvo. Nubia Zulema. Present, teacher. Karen Elena, she's here, okay. Beatriz Emilet, Lucero Perez. And Edgar Jose, okay. Perfect. Este le corresponde quedarse a Ronald Gómez. Okay, Ronald, sorry. Sorry. Ronald. Teacher. Yeah. Eh, the Monday. Eh, me toca a mí. No sé cómo es. Let me see. Yes. Oh, one on one. Yes, lunes. Mm, okay. okay. So, toma la sequena, además nos vamos. People, have a good Thank weekend. You, nice. Have a good weekend, okay? Enjoy with your family, friends, with your lovers, with your ex, I don't know who, but just enjoy. Teacher. Bye. <laughs> Bye. 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 Ya pasó Bye. la lista, teacher. Bye. Yes, I'm going to say good night. Good night. Dios los bendiga a todos y a todas. Dios. Hay weekend. Good night. Good night.
teacher me desconectó el, el, el Inter cuando pasó la lista. <risa> ok. Ok. Yes, no problem. Nos vemos el lunes. Sorry. Nos vemos el, el lunes. Ok. God willing, okay. I will see you. I will see you on Monday. All right. Take care. Okay. Enjoy. Thank you, teacher. Bye. Sonia? Nubia? Okay. No. Hey, Ronald. Hello. Hello, teacher. How are you? I'm fine, teacher. Excellent. Okay. I'm fine. I'm fine, but mm, not that, not that mm, good, teacher. Oh, okay. I understand. Ronald, do you have any questions about the classes, the topics in general? Yeah. No, don't. No, teacher. The class, the classmate is a class very excellent. How much content interesting. Mm -hmm. And this, this, this good, this good, teacher. Okay, it is good. All right. Uh, pero para aclarar, aclarar cualquier duda de temas que hemos visto hasta la fecha, algún tema que haya dificultado para reforzarlo uh, un poco. Sí, uh, yes, uh, the, the topic, uh, uh, the topic difficult, uh, no, to be, to be uh, difficult uh, is uh, there is and yeah, there are. Uh -huh. uh, me, me un poco. I can give you a, a, a quick explanation, a quick explanation, okay? Mm. Usamos, uh, usamos there is and there are con sustantivos. En inglés se llaman nouns, okay? Por eso usamos there is and there are, Solo con, solamente con esto, okay? Yes. <clears throat> we use there is or there are to show, to express. Usamos el there is y el there are para, para expresar la existencia de un sustantivo. Okay, or para introducir un sustantivo. We use there is, there is in Spanish is I. Okay, I. Usamos el there is con uh, sustantivos singulares. And for, for example, for example, he, she, it, did you? No, no, no. Eso es diferente. Eso es diferente. Eso es, bueno, ya, ya le explico, espérame. Me decía, me decía uh, Ronald. Uh, the, the, the use, uh, the use, uh, there is uh, singular nouns, for example, uh, he, she, it. I? Ah, no, no, eso, eso, esos son pronombres. Me refiero a, a sustantivos, sustantivos singulares, como objetos, personas que son en singular. Eh, por, eh, por ejemplo, borol. Sorry? Borol, eh, botella. Ajá, yes. Así podemos decir acá, let me, let me give you an example. Vamos a decir, there is a bottle of water. Look, there's a bottle of water on the table. Hay una botella en la mesa. Botella con agua, okay, en la mesa. That's one example. Mm -hmm. Bottle es el sustantivo, okay, el objeto. Entonces usamos mm -hmm. el there is para introducir o presentar o expresar la existencia de ese objeto, que es la botella con agua. 
¿ok? Entonces, barrel es singular, botella. ¿Ok? Uh, hey, call, call yourself, uh, for example, the, to, to me. Uh, por ejemplo, control, uh, mouse, computer. Uh -huh. Siempre que sea singular, uh, cualquier cosa. TV. Personal. Persona, animal o cosa. Mirror. Uh, there is a there is a mirror in the in the pared, no sé cómo se dice. Wall, on the wall. Uh -huh. También. Yes, yes. There's a mirror on the wall. Uh -huh. There is a dog in my house. Uh -huh. There is a police station in the park. Okay. So, some of them there is para singulares, okay? And there are is used for plural. There are apples in the Apple. basket. Canasta. La canasta. Hay manzanas en la canasta. Uh, Prácticamente. There are, there are balls, balls in the bag. In the what? In the bag. 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 Bolsa. Ah. Bag, yes. There are balls in the bag. Yes, that's what it is. Okay, uh, there are hay niños jugando videojuegos. Play games. Playing video games. Okay. Sí, yo, yo tenía la duda porque a veces, bueno, hay otras reglas que ahí se contradicen, ¿no? porque como Apple, a veces en, en singular, nos decían que pues, cuando era con S estaba en singular. Uh -huh. Sin S eh, ya viene siendo plural. O sea, yo antes me confundía porque hay una regla de eso, Ticho. Sí, sí, sí. En ese caso sí. Ah, recuerde, con la S es plural, excepto con unos, con unos cuantos que no cambian porque son irregulares, pero la mayoría... Acá tenemos Battle, Mirror, Dog, and Police Station, que se pueden hacer plurales, que son uh, Battles, Mirrors, and Dogs, and Police Stations. Ok, Apple, Balls, Children, no, porque ya, ya Child es uno y Children es plural. Ok, La cosa, así es como va. Lo, 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 lo que llaman de entonces el There Is y el There Are. Uh -huh. Eso es todo, ¿verdad? Si usted usa There Is, el objeto, animal, persona o cosa que use tiene que ir en singular. Si usted usa there are, el objeto o el sustantivo, ya sea persona, animal o cosa, tiene que ir en, en plural. Ok, teacher. Yes. Así es como. No más eso, teacher. Ok, that is perfect. También que me disculpe porque a veces me cuesta entrar como salgo tarde del trabajo. Yo, yo entiendo, Ronald, no, entiendo, entiendo. Que Pero lo felicito por el, por el, porque siempre trata de, aunque esté a tarde, siempre está aquí. Eso es muy bueno, ¿ok? Eso es muy bueno, que persevera así, ¿ok? No, como así, yo aunque sea, aunque sea, trato la manera de comprender lo que hablan, va a entenderlo. Sí, pero imagínese que usted, imagínese, entra las, digamos que entra las nueve, viene a medias, porque no, no sabe de qué estamos hablando. Se viene un poco perdido. Y ¿Sí? Eso me gusta, que trate de adaptarse rápidamente a lo que estamos trabajando. Excelente. Sí, sí. Siga así, Ronald, siga así. Okay. Okay. Muchas okay. gracias, teacher. Cuídense y nos vemos el día lunes, ¿ok? Good night, teacher. Good night. Have a good weekend. Bye-bye.